Let's get more from Cecilia Vega at the White House. And Cecilia, since about Friday afternoon, the White House certainly seemed to switch into a much higher state of alert. Yeah, they are sounding the alarm. George, good morning to you. And officials here say they still don't know whether or not Putin has decided to invade. But in terms of that critical alarm, they say their intelligence shows Russia has strategically built up and moved its forces on the Ukrainian border to a point that an invasion could now be imminent. They say they can't predict the exact day, but that we are now in the window for a possible invasion that it could happen at any time. President Biden, you mentioned those urgent phone calls, George. He spoke with Ukraine's leader on Sunday. He reiterated that the U.S. will respond swiftly and decisively. On Saturday, he had that more than an hour-long phone call with Putin. There was no breakthrough. Russia in that phone call accusing the United States of inflaming hysteria. But perhaps, TJ, a slight glimmer of hope in all this. Both sides have agreed, Russia and the U.S., to keep their teams talking. But again, the U.S. reiterating right now that we could be looking at an imminent attack in a matter of days. TJ. All right, Cecilia, thank you so much. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.